skin on these inches. Hey, yo, what's going on? Our friend Poppy Mitchell has just been spotted in a high-speed chase with the cops! Like, like right now, bro! Apparently she's wasted! Get after them! See if you can snag a shot of her getting busted! Sounds good. I guess that's her! Man, how the fuck I get myself into this? Photo. What can I say? A great journalism. Our little sex tape sent sloppy poppy in a full blown meltdown. <laughs> How does it feel to be on the front lines, dude? Shit, it ain't exactly Iraq, man. And you know what? I might feel a little less degraded if I was fucking getting paid. Ah, all in good time. The truth comes first. I'll be in touch. You know Princess Georgina, that snooty English royal? She, and not really. She don't kick it in Chamberlain Hills much. Well, word has it she likes to blaze one for queen and country, if you know what I mean. <laughs> that there's a deal going down right now. I need you to meet my contact outside Chico's hypermarket. And try not to blow his cover, okay? All right, man, this one I got. 
I'll hit you when it's done. Yo, you Beverly's boy? Shit, I guess I am, huh? They're round back. Heavy security. I'd take a photo from the roof if I was you. Okay, I gotta go. This conversation never happened. Yeah, I got you, homie. It's good. I have sticky cowboy, minus passion, purple plunder, endless panic, whatever you want. Marvelous. I'll take it all. <laughs> okay. I am on holiday. I mean, apart from a few photo shoots of the Forthens and Chris. do this for me, but they're like super scared of being arrested and totally banged by scary dudes in US jail, yeah? So like, so Headlines, all those highness puns. <laughs> I am gonna be rich. Don't you mean we? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mikasa, Tukasa, you know. I I'll catch you later. I need to get this to print. Got off lucky, homie. You are looking totes delicious. Where you at, Mr. Revolutionary? What? The smoke in. I'm at City Hall. I'm the only fool here. Uh, uh, uh yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'll be right there. I, uh, uh, I didn't forget I was busy. Yeah, uh, busy, that's it. <laughs> Fight the power. Sweet mother. I am looking forward to the weekend, I tell you. That's what I'm talking about. Man, this fucking fool don't even know what year it is. It's a great fucking city, but the traffic kills me. My good deed for the day. Wow, insane! I'd say you earned yourself a reward, bro.
start, you piece of crap! I feel horrible. What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, it's my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The He's truth. A... Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, but some people. <laughs> They no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met him, Michael. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Huh? By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. Or does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier, he's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down and get the files back. A man, what's the pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor. 
Come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! ¿Qué no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right. Hey, and let's stay in touch on the headsets. Yeah, okay. Well, I ain't at the observatory yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there. To that guy's house? Understood. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that you might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? Statues, whatever. The guy has trouble getting it up. We'll clear two, three million on those. Easy. Perverts will pay anything for hope. We weren't casing the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job. So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him. But it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? The fuck? All right, I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down, and I'll be ready. T. If you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet! There it is. I'll pass downtown. <laughs> Gotta shoot in front to compensate for the speed of the jet.
number nine of Charlie Echo. Say your souls on board. Two souls on board. Engine two totally lost. All hydraulics lost. All hydraulic systems are gone. Roger, November 9 to Charlie Echo. Where are you putting it down? We're not going to make the runway. Going to have to ditch the son of a bitch and hope for the best. Take him to Madrezzo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. Oh my god!
What? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works, a little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor! Trevor! Ah. I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that. Where is he? Uh, the fuck has happened? Why did he have his car? Man, that piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What? Happened, cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Trevor, don't. Answer a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while oh. while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you hop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out, you know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot, a little getaway, if you will, a cabin in the woods, you know what I'm saying. Chop. Yo, get in, Chop.
Get out of here, Chop. Back on. I think I nailed it on take seven. Hey, Bev! Oh, man, you fucking ruined the shot. You ruined the fucking shot! What the fuck you talking about? You ruined the fucking shot. It's a fucking reality show, and you ruined it, homie. Homie's got you them photos. Poppy Mitchell, the English princess, the others. Oh, right, man, you know? <laughs> Don't even remember, right? The whole thing is like... But what about my money? We're shooting a show here, trying to work. Hello? I'll just, you know, have somebody call my agent or something. Man, fuck you. Whatever. Uh, back to one. Please, we're shooting something. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Now, where, now where were we? Uh, guys, do, do we have enough shots of me jumping around the corner? Uh, I think we're good. We'll cut Poppy's reaction in when we get back to the studio. Awesome. I can't believe the effort I used to go to for celebrity shots. If I'd known I could just get my agent to call their agent and stage it all, my life would have been so much easier. Yeah, well, welcome to the big leagues, my friend. Let's get some lead-in lines, and then we'll wrap. Sure thing. Uh -huh. Hey, Molly. I'm outside the studio. All right. Go over the wall and find the car on the lot. And then what? Only the principal actors and stunt people are authorized to go near it. So, you could get in wardrobe and play the part or try something else. All right. When you're out of there and clear of studio security, call me.
Huh? Yeah, I think I think I get it. Cut! Uh, has anyone got any uh, rock cocaine? After that take, I really need some. Back to your marks. Now, action. This fruit salad has pineapple in it. I don't know how many times I have to tell you I'm allergic. Do you understand? Do you understand? Now listen to me. Just get the fuck out of here. I'm sick of looking at your face, Tina. I train. You need to get on set. Where the hell is Brandon? Jesus, are you gonna find him? Someone's gonna find him. Anyone know who this guy is? Is this the new stunt guy? I thought I had final approval on all stunt performers. Get out of the car. Get that guy out of there. He's not signed off. the wheel I need to get the fuck out of here studio security are shutting your ass down wacko oh fuck we gonna lose these guys is this an abduction nah you cool no I'm not cool not at all I mean chill out I'm just interested in the whip this button say spikes what do you mean the whip I can buy this car with what I make in the morning I think you underestimating the value of this automobile. I think you underestimating the value of this automobile. Are overestimating your own talent. Uh, I think you're underestimating what I get paid. You get paid a couple million for a morning's work? Shit, I should sack my agent. Yeah, shit. Stockholm Syndrome won't work on me, fuckball. Look, I respect you as an artist and a human being, but I got other priorities. I've been abducted by a crazed fan! Oh, please! I like some of your work, but don't get ahead of yourself! What's wrong with you? Didn't your parents love you when you were a child? My dad disappeared. My mom was a crackhead. But that ain't what this about. My parents loved me so much, they put me in a little lazy surprise campaign when I was three. Mm, good for you. I didn't work till I was ten. You are so going to... Drop it. Let's so go. going to get the electric chair. This is more lethal injection, gas chamber kind of state. But thank you. Oh. Oh. People who hurt celebrities are treated worse than pedophiles in prison, and rightly so. Whatever you say. You're gonna kill me, aren't you? Oh, I'm another sacrifice to the god of celebrity. This ain't a sacrifice. It's a carjacking. Now calm the fuck down. Damn, what's this button do? Everyone wants a piece of me. Directors, agents. If you have the car, bring it to Hayes Auto in South LS. Mr. Weston is marathon training, but he can change his route and meet you there. Yeah, okay. Because I got the car and it was messy. That's fine with us, but your associate, Michael DeSanta, has done some work at the studio and he might not be so happy. Yeah, yeah, whatever. What kind of shape is the car in? Well, Whatever, we plan on refitting the guns to take live ammunition. Do the traffic spike and ejector seat need replacing too? Uh, both of those are going to need replacing, all right? Good. One more thing. Mr. Weston's security detail are concerned about a suspicious figure near the garage. Let us know if you see something.
You're developing quite the rep there, Slick. Insurance companies hate these kinds of claims. They don't like cats with the inside edge shorting them either. So how'd it go? Smooth enough, you know. Movie people. You know what the irony is? I'm a major shareholder in that same studio, so we just did is practically legal. Ha! Practically. Ooh, shit! Look at this motherfucker. You doing it big, my nigga, on the set. Lamar, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, chirped your boy Trevor. It's fucked up when you gotta get your GPS location on your homeboys through a motherfucking speed freak. True that. Devin Weston, master of the two-hour female orgasm. What it is, Holmes? Lamar Davies. He was just leaving. Hey, not on my account. You looking for gainful employment, homie? Hell yeah, I'm always trying to get some motherfucking paper. Just the type of guy I like to work with. Predictable. Hey, we could bring your boy here in on the last part of the shipment. Oh, yeah, nigga, that's exactly what you could do. That's exactly Hell what you yeah. could do right man, there, look, man. Exactly. If you want him in, then you get him to boost the rest of the shit you got. Oh. Give me my money and I can go on oh, with my motherfucking oh. life. Oh, no, am I sensing tension here, Slick? <gasps> He's the spirit, but you're the brains. Am I wrong? I can see it. Look, I need you on point when we move this stuff out of town. Yeah, whatever, man. Call me when it's done. And after this, make sure we got our motherfucking check, all right? Ciao, baby. It is what it is. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, come here. I'm gonna put you in touch with my legal counsel. Hey, hey, don't touch me, homie. I don't get down like that. Yeah, let me tell you how the world works, Slim. Got off lucky, homie. Somebody, somebody stop that man! Hey there, can't wait to meet up later. What do you say? <laughs> of your life. Where do you find happiness? I'm happy. I'm free. 
and for a reasonable investment of time. What's up, homie? How's everything going with you? Great. Really great. How are you? Well, I know how you are. So it's true what they say about you weirdos then? Hey, last night, I was in 45 different places at the same time. I know my truth, brother, brother. <laughs> Good for you then, homie. You can ignore me, but you cannot ignore the truth.